Today, a Charlottesville Circuit Court jury recommended that white supremacist James Alex Fields Jr. spend life plus 419 years in prison for murdering 32-year-old paralegal Heather Heyer and for wounding eight others. On August 12, 2017, after attending the racist Unite the Right rally, James Alex Fields Jr. used his Dodge Challenger as a weapon of death. He stalked a crowd of peaceful protesters at the corner of 4th and Market Streets in downtown Charlottesville before backing up and then driving his car directly into the crowd. On Friday, December 7th, the jury found Fields Jr. guilty of 10 charges, including first-degree murder. After a hearing yesterday in which Heather Heyer's mother, Susan Bro, testified, the jury deliberated for two hours before calling it a day. Deliberations resume today, and the jury delivered their recommendation to the court. During the hearing, Susan Bro told the jury, Heather was full of love, full of justice, and full of fairness. Mr. Fields tried to silence her, Bro said. She continued saying, but I refuse to allow that. I'm the type of mom, if you mess with my kid on the playground, it's on. I stood up in her place. I talked to everyone who will listen about her and about hate. Last week during the trial, prosecutors played recordings for the jury of phone calls between Fields Jr. and his mother after he killed Hire and was in jail awaiting trial. In those phone calls, Fields Jr. calls Susan Bro an anti-white communist. At one point, Fields' mother tells him Bro is not a communist and that she just lost her daughter, to which Fields Jr. replied, quote, it doesn't fucking matter. She's a communist, end quote. During yesterday's hearing, Fields Jr. did not take the stand. Like the racist, bigoted coward he is, he didn't even apologize to Bro or the other victims in the courtroom. Bro said, quote, I don't hate Mr. Fields. I'm leaving him in the hands of justice, end quote. The jury delivered justice, recommending Fields Jr. spend the rest of his natural life in prison for killing Heather Heyer. The jury also recommended Fields Jr. spend 70 years in prison for each of his five aggravated malicious wounding convictions and 20 years in prison for each of his three malicious wounding convictions, as well as nine years in prison for his felony hit and run conviction for a total of life plus 419 years in prison. Fields Jr. will officially be sentenced in March by Judge Richard Moore. In Virginia, it's very rare that a judge goes against the jury's recommendation for sentencing. Let this sentence be a warning to any other white supremacist neo-Nazis that are thinking about coming to Virginia and carrying out violent crimes in the name of hatred, racism, and bigotry. In the Breaking Through Newsroom, Theodore Whitelow, Breaking Through News.